children in this video through some interesting examples we will better understand expanding two digit numbers using place value and writing in the boxes of tens and ones billy here are some anklet beads so can you count them and tell me how many beads to put in the tens and ones boxes of this abacus yes sure look lily first i will make groups of 10 with the anklet beads 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 i have made their group like this wow Now let me count the anklet beads besides this group. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Here I made the second group of ten. Again, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Here I made a third group of ten. Now let me count the beads we have left uncounted. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. It means the total number of beads are thirty-seven. Here there are three groups of tens. That's why I will put three beads in tens box, and seven beads in ones box. Well done, Billy. Can you tell me that what number do the remaining beads on the abacus make? Think about it and tell me. Look, on this abacus here in the tens box, there are one, two, and three beads available. So we will write that first. Now in the ones box, there are seven beads. So we have to write seven. Now the number it makes is thirty-seven. Very good. Come, Come on, on. Now, now let, let us, us go. go. Children, today in this video, with the help of some interesting examples, we learn to expand two-digit numbers and write them in the box of tens and ones. In the next video, we will understand some interesting facts about tens and ones. Thank <laughs> you.